Hey guys, and welcome back to Stray, the kitty sci-fi adventure where I am a fugitive. I've literally just escaped from the robot prison that is here in Midtown. I don't think I'm allowed to go back because my good buddy and friend Clementine is leading the police off away from our scent. I, the robot, the robots track by scent, I assume so. They do all sorts of weird things in the future here, like eating and drinking. One of them looked like it even got drunk, which I found rather suspicious for a robot to be doing. Anyway, we are trying to make our way up to the surface. Look, lower town, upper town, you are here. We're making our way to the exit. We will use this subway system, as was the plan of Clementine. We need to try and make our way back to... There's a power system somewhere, because whilst the reason that we got arrested... Now, may, maybe, just maybe, we might have stolen an atomic battery from the Nico Corporation. The Nico Corporation are in, tar in charge of keeping this city clean and tidy but you know what I feel like they've been failing at their job and we're coming along to try and like free all of robot kind from their oppressive oppressive regime we are indeed going to be using this battery thank you very much and let's try and get everything up and running welcome to the Nico Corporation or an eco I don't I don't know how we're supposed to be pronouncing that it's obviously um, n dot eco uh, but that that's a thing all right so the the, the subway station or the subway train sorry is up and running I don't know about you guys but I would I would just try and call the vehicle itself a subway and I know that's wrong perhaps a metro metro's a little bit more um, international shall we say subway to some people is just the walk underneath the ground uh it, it words are very interesting but yeah i think i think we'll call this one the metro from now on let's jump up onto the seat because of course i am a super intelligent cat that can use oh we've got the key i forgot that we've got the key uh, of course clementine stole the key for us we have no idea how they managed to do that they just had and uh we we now have the key okay so we fire up we open the door this door has not been opened open for i'm guessing millennia because there have been robots in prison for like 700 years or so so for that to, for the robots even to have evolved to the state of needing prison must have taken a while uh, and then 700 years in prison i i think i think this place has been going for a couple of thousand years and at the shortest at the shortest okay so now that the subway is going wait are we just literally here to walk around i mean i'm gonna i want to look out the back i want to look out the back i can't i we, we can't we can't look out the back that that's kind of sad it's all very dark here and i'm not, ooh, 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 we got some lights up the front and i'm not sure whether um it, it's good gameplay to be able to not look at, i can't jump up on any of the seats i can't do anything that i would normally assume that i would be able to oh now that we've come to a stop i'm allowed to do that walled city nine 99 and uh, welcome to the world's safest city beautiful we've seen this advert before a rat it's a robot I didn't I wasn't expecting you to be here hello who are you uh, how, uh, helper 477 hello may I how may I help you and that's it that's the end of the conversation okay uh, we could have asked for like the way to the egg look there's an exit sign over there and there's an exit sign over there we've got ourselves a vending machine we've been able to extract stuff from vending machines in the past but turns out today is not one of those days there is a stairway going up there i feel like i maybe wanted to have checked that door out first probably shouldn't be jumping on the uh, on the train line sounds like a bad way to move across okay i don't see anything there but i did hear a little plink when we were down here and normally that means there was something to interact with uh and i must have just been making things up when i when i heard that okay that that's fine that is the way of things sometimes wow 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 enjoy the world's safest city complete with a picture of the outside this uh this whole place looks pretty cool over here and by that i mean clean sterile you know cool um let's carry on going how are these helpers able to keep everything mm, i wonder i wonder whether the helpers have been um held back from evolving hello how are you doing can we talk greetings inhabitants of wall city 99 greetings helper 62 how are you doing do i pronounce the zero are you zero six two oh i i don't i don't know um I want to jump up here onto yeah get my paws in the paint the problem is i've got my paws deep in paint look at that and um i'm not leaving footprints behind here well actually i kind of look look at that one right there 
Okay, may maybe I'll let them off. I thought that wasn't happening, but hey. How are you doing, Helper211? I'm currently painting this area. Please be careful of wet, wet paint and have a nice day. You too. Have a great day. Um, that's good. It's a bit bit of a, an imposition to insist that they have a great day. You know, have an okay day, have a fine day, stuff like that. I think people can just make that one happen. But a great day, that's pretty hard to achieve. The city has been sealed. Violating the rules of confinement will likely result in a heavy prison sentence. What is a heavy prison sentence? Hello. I got out. I busted out of prison before, so it's not a problem. Greetings, inhabitants of Wall City 99. This door is uh, leading to the surface and currently locked due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to a certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Have a nice day. I mean, I can have a nice day. Thank you very much. I, I will indeed go forth and have a, gr a, a nice day. We, we, we've already said that maybe a great day is uh, putting a little too much on me here. I just, I just kind of want to climb over and have a look. Yeah, no, look, it looks safe. It looks good. What, what, what's under here? What 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 are in these packets? They look like maybe we've got some sort of like seating replacements or something like that. Is it all? Well, then, then what's this over here? What's in the blue stuff? All right, well let's talk to this guy. Gray as well, different. Hello, how may I help you? Well, I'm trying to open the door. I don't know if you can help me open the door. Uh, my my good buddy and friend B12, the robot that follows me around here. Um, used to be human, would you believe? Used to be human and now uh, is in a droid. After a short time, you know, maybe a couple of thousand years, uh, trapped inside a computer system with no sensors for the outside world. Look at it. It's it's the walled city. It's the entire walled city. There's Midtown over there, maybe Outtown. Uh, that that's the slums down below. Oh, this this is glorious. Well, greetings. Who are you? Hey, helper one six one. Your current task is clean the window. Uh, please refer to any certified in uh, certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. And have a nice day. You have a nice day too. I wonder how long he's been rubbing that window. I bet I bet it was like inches thicker than it is now. <laughs> oh, there's there's a, there's a newspaper. Can we can we read the newspaper? No, it's written. It's written in the robot language. We can't. We can't do that. Okay, that's a shame. Um, that that is a great shame. Even if it was written in French, I believe the language that this game was coded into, I'd be able to kind of try and pick it apart. But no, not not even. Hello, who are you? Helper seven nine five. Hello, this city has been sealed for your safety. Please refer to a certified engineer inside the control room if you have any requests. Okay, I bet there's no certified engineers. Do do you think we could just put on a certified engineer badge? and just pretend oh hello we've played with you all type before okay well let, let's come over here and see if we can do anything inspect that panel hello how are you we are inspecting totally not hacking just a just an inspection the control room is closed by some sort of pro security pro protocol ah i can't speak all of a sudden it says that only humans are authorized to enter it also says that i'm not considered human that's offensive, you security protocol. That is offensive. Maybe if we work together, we can open the passageway. Maybe. There's nothing quite like a bit of teamwork to open up such things. Okay, so I can't go up there at the moment. I think I think I might know the simple and easy way to make it work. Why are there little dust motes all around this um this tree? I oh no 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 it's 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 um rounded bottoms and square bottoms okay it's a bit offensive as well i mean how am i supposed to know whether i've got a rounded or a square bottom uh let's turn this on uh, and then it's going to follow me look watch this yeah it's it's my new robot friend sorry b12 uh we, we have several robot friends are we supposed to just stop it over here is this the indication that the oh ooh, ooh, it moved me uh yes we have done it right there's the almost guaranteed because we did that um i can't press the y button now Ooh, I was kind of expecting that just to work. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Um, we get B12 out? No, okay, all right. There must be something else we do here. Let's press the up button. No, that's our inventory. Press the down button, and what have you got? I can't open this door alone. We need to work together. Yeah, okay, well, how do we... How do we do? I can't open it. We need to work. Yeah, okay. Okay. Well, maybe if we put you over here, inspect that, and then whilst you're... Yeah, okay. Whilst you're doing that, we jump up, and now we interact with this. Am I just going to rip some wires apart? This does not seem like a fail-safe door. Wait, maybe it is fail-safe, because the safe is open, right? That 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 is a thing that uh, occurs in the real world. 
you know, we have things that when they break, they make it so that you can open panels and stuff like that. Okay, I think we're going to bring this, this bad boy through. No. Oh, but we've got a little panel here. Surely, surely this is where we want the robots to stand. We, we've been taught that this is a thing that we do. And, oh, the door closed. I don't, I don't know whether that's a thing we want to do. Oh, the doors are just opening and closing. This is fine. We'll accept this. Okay, well, what have we got around here now? This is the control room for the entire city. They controlled everything from here. And it's empty. Yes. Yes, it is a very empty. I remember hating them so much. They had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. Little good it did them. Oh, yeah. The plague. I remember now. Do you? Do you really? Everyone was dying. And they thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. I watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. That sounds horrific. But I still can help you. We can still go outside. Together. I will carry the memories of humanity and all the people that I loved. Oh, dude, that, that's very sweet. That is very sweet. Look at all the memories we forgot, though. We, we're, miss we are, we're missing 25% of our memories. That's that's a shame. Though, to be fair, I think I, as a human, have forgotten more than 25% of my life. So, uh, I don't know. Has the robot really missed out that much? Um, I can't imagine the, uh, the burden of having perfect memory and then not having perfect memory. You know, I, I should imagine that is quite quite the shock to go from one to the other. Oh, look, look, all the way down there. I'm sure some of these slum streets we know quite well. Like that one over there. Isn't that where Momo lived? You see the uh, the, the yellow sign there. And then that, that one is the orange building, the tallest building in the city that we had to hook up, a, um, hook up an antenna to. What was that square that was lighting up on the wall over there? I feel like it's actually a reflection from over here somewhere. Uh, that that might very well be the case, and we we don't really want to go chasing reflections. It's uh, it's a hard enough life just being a cat without chasing rubbish stuff. Is the music? Oh, it's the tape. Okay, that that's cool. I think I think we're playing some 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 good music. Uh, okay, let's try and jump up here. It's a bit glitchy, but that's fine. Look at this control panel here. Who has CRTV monitors in the in the, the, the desks nowadays? What what happened to the OLED panels? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, how are we so far into the future yet still using such terrible tech? Uh, out outside this this one, look this this appears to be another control room in there maybe, or maybe we're just reflecting. No, because the screens are off. Look. These screens are all off, so those screens inside must be different screens. Uh, either that or it's um, slightly poor game design. We uh, we don't actually know. 22. Can I, can I walk through this door? Is this a thing? No, no, we can't. Not allowed through the door. Uh, I do see a little flashing light over here. Let, let's press the button and have a look. It's the control panel. This is it. The main computer. Oh, he's going to upload himself, isn't he? Wait, we know he's going to sacrifice himself for the city. It's the only way he's going to be able to do it. I'm just going to just going to throw that cliche ending out there. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city is stuck in lockdown cycle from a long go, uh, from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. I need to bring the rest of these systems back online. All right, you do that. These computers hold the data we need. Okay, we need to turn them on. All right. Uh, what do you? Uh, while you do that, I'll look for the passwords and encrypted keys to get into the system. Good, good work, good work. I mean, what? How do? How does I? How does I? A small little cat turn a computer system on? Uh, I mean, I I don't think it's that much beyond me because. We've done a lot already. Oh, look at this down here. We've done a lot already. Um, and I feel like just just given what I have achieved, that turning some switches on isn't gonna be um isn't gonna be too difficult. Uh, it should be fine up here. Is this mm, no switches here either? Okay. Can't we just pull the fire alarm? Um is that is that not a thing we're allowed to do? If we pull the fire alarm do, do we not then open the doors and let people outside where we, we file out in an orderly manner, line up in the car park and make sure everybody's here who we think is here? My backpack turned purple and that makes me, th makes me feel like there's stuff around. Hello? Purple? Purple? Is it, is it just actually uh, B12 doing a thing? It could be. It could be. I'm still not sure what it is we're looking for. I'm just walking around the outside at the moment. Um, and I'm not not seeing anything that looks like a switch. 
or a or a Wii? No, no, a switch or a, a, a lever or some sort of button. All, all of these things I feel like would be useful. Can we open this door? No, elevator does not lead where we want it to go. Wait, did the elevator go down to the slums? Oh, we've, we've seen elevators in slums before, so maybe that is the way. Uh, now all the lights are on. Okay, that that's good. That's good. Room 20? Can we go into room 20? No, no, we can't. I could can already tell that that is not a thing. Uh, okay, so up on the panels here, we've got some lights on. C6 and C5. Okay, C4, C1. Oh, I turned them all off. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Look over here. We've got some buttons up on the wall, like some some diagrams, shall we say. You, you see this here? Uh, computer, 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 control. Hey, B12, you doing all right? Can we talk? Uh, these long rows of computers need to be turned on. Okay, yeah, I, I was actually just figuring that out. Thanks very much. I'm glad that they give us um, little little symbols like that. Uh, I'm turning them off. Okay, let, this is good. That one. Okay. All right, we, I think we've got this nailed now. Or at least I managed to uh, whoop, 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 uh, walk on all the, the keyboards in the right order. Uh, it, it's a very important thing to be able to do is walk on things in the right order. Uh are these now all off? There, 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 and there. Is that all of them? It looks like all of them. Hey, we did it. It worked. Good job, my friend. I found it. Did you? Uh, I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Ah, uh, mate. You're, you're going to be... Wait, maybe there's a way around it. Oh, dude, don't do it. Don't do it. We'll just leave. We'll go out through a, an air vent or something. Like, the robots are happy. Oh, it's locked. System locked. Why, why is the system locked? There! That's the workstation to open the city. But there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. Okay. We need... Uh, now what we need to do... What well, Now we need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. Okay. I I, I mean, I'm, I'm down. I can destroy things. Not not this. Are we not we're not destroying this. Okay. Well, let, let's go see what else we can destroy and uh, get away. This looks like something. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, I don't really want to be up top here. That my jump just got the better of me. No, we're not ripping it out of there. Okay. I thought maybe we'd be ripping stuff out of out of the wall. Uh, maybe maybe we do want to be up here then. Uh, we can open this up. Press some buttons. Okay. And then we uh, scritchy scratch on here. Yeah. Oh. Using my cat powers for good. Okay, that's good. Um, th there's a hack button there. Wait, let, let, me, let me back down. Let me back down. I want to see this. Okay, B12, what are you doing? Uh, that's a rather direct interface you've got there. Ow! Mate, are you all right? The, the system is taking more than I expected. Dude, are you going to be okay? Are we, are we going to have an emotional moment at the end here? Intrusion alert! Intrusion alert. Oh no, we've got to keep going. Okay, we can do, we can keep going. I mean, here looks like another system that we need to uh, to do a thing for. So if I jump up here, can we push this panel out the way? It looks like a thing I want to do. Okay, we've learned how to push the panels from the past. Uh, and now if we jump down, there must be a thing to just kind of rip up here. Yeah, like like this. I pressed Y twice. That that was not what we needed to do. Uh, we scratch everything up. And okay, this, this is good now. We should have a new hack panel up here. Pressing the button gives us an interaction up. B12, I don't think that's safe. Mate, uh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> that, that's roughly what I was thinking. Don't worry, I can recharge once we open the workstation. I'd rather you did it now, to be honest. Can we just take a little moment? Is that a thing we can do? I'd, I'd much rather we just took a little moment together. Um, okay, not not a thing to be done over here. Wait, where, where would the final hack panel be? I've not seen anything anywhere else, so I can only assume it's up here. Let's um, interact with stuff. No, nothing nothing really to interact with over here. Maybe. Uh, we, we're going to once again. Oh, no, here we go. I was going to say we'll once again have to walk around the entire room until we find something, right? But here we go. We found the thing. Time to get my catty powers out. Yep. J just like that. Beautiful. And then we rip this up. I wonder why this isn't causing me any troubles. You know, B12 goes and interf interfaces with the direct prongs. I'm ripping wires apart. Not a single bit of problems come my way. 
Oh, B12, mate. Seriously. I, I think this little body is done for. It's okay. I'll be all right. Just carry me to the workstation. We can disable the alarm. Uh, okay. I mean, as a cat, I have no idea what you're saying. So we, we, we'll just do the thing that we think he says he's saying, and uh, that that will be fine. Am I? Am I not? Is this not good enough? Which workstation? I, I really thought this was going to be the workstation we needed. Uh, why? Okay, let's let's interface here. The city is sealed, but how long will that seal continue? That's it. We're safe. Roof control system operational. Listen, I have something to tell you. I knew the power required to disable the city, city central control system would be immense. More than this drone's body could handle. But with the security now disabled, I can take control of the si system and open the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. Not the software, but I made a choice when I hooked into that first computer and the consequences it would bring. The robots won't care, mate. Like, they're very happy with what they're doing. I'm sorry we won't see the outside together. I thought I needed to carry on, carry on to them. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see the future is in the companions. And you. Here, let me take that off you. No, not my backpack. I've got very... Ah, uh, my badges. <laughs> you were my friend. The very best I could have asked for. Thank you. I'll be 12 though. No, I don't want you. B12, no. Uh, I, sp I suppose it's okay. Like, we, we only really met him less than six hours ago. So, I mean, it was an intense six hours, i got to say. No, uh, mate. Maybe he just uploaded himself to the mainframe again. And all would be good at that point. Oh, don't, don't do that. that. That is just far too cute for a gamer to put up with at this point in the game. Um, I'd, ra I'd rather we didn't. I'm just gonna chill here. Like, really, what what are the robots gonna do when they turn up and find that everything's been broken? I I don't know. Do you hear that? Do you hear little mechanical noises? I'm sure I hear something. Oh, we've got some percentages moving. <laughs> Thousands die as debris falls from the roof. <laughs> wow! But the light. The light falls down. That is so intense. Isn't that going to do something crazy to the Zergs? Yeah, I was just thinking. Wait, have we have we perpetuated another form of genocide here? Uh, I'm not. I'm not sure that I'm entirely happy. They were just trying to make their way through. Hopefully, some of them escape. I, I actually wish that some of the Zergs escape because it was. It's not their fault that they were given the genetic code that they were given. Hey, Momo. How's it going? You having a good time? Momo was our very good friend. Oh, that's also the um, the Guardian. And we've got Doc down there. This is everybody in the slums. Do they even know Clementine? Yes. Wait, why, why did the Sentinels die when exposed to light? What's going on with that? What what's up with that? But good work, Clementine. Got got free. Looks like they're safe. I hope they're safe. I really do. I want I want all my friends to be safe. Not sure what we get. Oh, look at the sky. Is that actual sky? No, it's not actual sky yet. But it's trying to be. It's trying to be. Maybe I just want to stay curled up with my little friend B12 here. I, I I'm not allowed to move. Am I allowed to move? I'm trying I'm trying to press buttons here. We're we're gonna see what happens. Look at the light that is coming in from the side. Uh, I'm definitely picking him up. Oh no, that was that was just to lay down and be chill again. Um, well, if that's not what we're doing, then how are we doing? I I don't I don't actually know. We're gonna take the moment, as we do most episodes, to just chill and like take a little nap, watch the camera unfold, see the world changing around us whilst the camera zooms out here. Is that the maximum zoom? That looks like it might be the maximum. I, I kind of want to go just like look out the window. Um, let, let, let's leave B12 here for now. I don't think he's going anywhere. Um, yeah, look, look at all the stuff for like, if it's been thousands of years, there should be entire forest up there. You know, you know what I'm saying? Look at it! Wow, look at it. It's quite a small city, really. One might call it just a bit of a town. But that that's cool. That's cool. Wow. I don't know where we're going to go or what we're going to do from this point onwards. Um, I feel like... Who, who built the city so low down? How would they feel like it wouldn't just fill up with water? These, these are questions that I have for the designers of this place. But... There we go. I think that is the entire roof open. Did I live in the wall? Is that is that wall there the one that I've come from? Oh look, we're sealing up the outside as well. Okay, that's not look, there's the there's the elevator or an elevator. Anyway, there's the other one. Okay, that that's a thing. 
All right, B12? Yo, B12. You're, you're still not, are you? This makes me kind of sad. This does make me kind of sad. I'm so sad that I've suddenly developed hiccups. Hold me <laughs> for one moment. Well, I think it might just be worth going for a bit of a walk around here. Let's go see if there are any doors open that we can interface with. Uh, are any any robots? Oh, there's a door. There was a door all the way back, right? There was a door. I, I kind of I feel really bad about leaving B12 just on the floor there. Can I not pick him up and bring him with me? Like I I would put him in my in my cat house. Like yeah, the only thing we have here is to sleep, and I I don't I don't want to do that. Okay, well I, I guess we're just gonna have to make do for now and uh, wander outside. See. <sighs> I want to I wanna bring him outside. I, I feel kind of gutted that we're not allowed to bring my little robot friend outside. Hey, who are you? Hello. Uh, no, I'm not I'm not allowed to interact. Okay, let, let's not try and interact. Hello. The, why, why is this cordoned off? Have you not moved it yet? Okay, well, the city is open. Great. Can we talk? No, you're just going to namaste at me. Okay, that, that's fine. Ew. Look at this. Uh, I got like algae on my paws and all sorts here. Okay, well, we we had one goal this entire game. It was to see the sunlight again and go find my friends. But I feel like I've left I'm leaving some friends behind. And is that truly the way I want to be? I'm not entirely Wait, wait, this is where this is where we started the game, right? I'm I'm fairly sure this is the place where we slept. To begin with, and then we walked up the side. I, I, oh, that's that's crazy, crazy. Are we gonna meet meet my my cat friends? Is that gonna be a thing? I sure do hope so. Yeah, smell the fresh air. Oh, beautiful. Be in indeed. What about B12? Hey, but what about B12? The thing is, if they bring him back now, that's like an empty sacrifice. So, as much as I do want to see B12, I feel like it would undermine the story quite a bit if they did that right now um but as a cat these be these concerns are beyond me i've got no thumbs i i don't know why i should be bothered about any of it we're just gonna get out in the Ooh. ghost in the machine you say up, up, up. oh oh man what what a game I really enjoyed that. Though I, I didn't know really what to expect coming into this, and uh, the the walk and talk RPG was not it, but it, it's it's amazing. I really, really, really enjoyed that. There's a lot of uh, unanswered questions in the game, but I think that I think that adds to the mystique, right? The the, the allure of the game that we played here. Uh, but of course, such concerns are beyond my catty brain. Uh, we we made good friends. Uh, we made a lot of very good robots friends along the way we helped people out we made some badges um freed b12 from the darkness of the mainframe and then let him go back maybe i'm gonna just assume that b12 is now part of the city mainframe and that he is uh, living on helping the companions build their city up to be what it, it truly should have been the utopia that the humans thought they were creating when they first made the city uh, and not the dystopia that it ended up as is always the case i'm gonna leave this the uh, the credits running here all these people these many many people were involved in putting this project together and uh, it, it affected me you know i like there's emotional games there emotional uh, play there i b12 my friend i will remember you uh, Momo, all the outsiders, let's be honest, and, and the, the, the people, the, the companions. We never really answered the question of whether people are compa companions are people. I, I, I feel like, yes, maybe robots do count as people. Uh, I will see you guys next time when we're going to have another sci-fi adventure. Uh, I've got a few lined up that hopefully we can just kind of like bash out and play together. Uh, but I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye. Oh look, babies were born. Oh, a bunch of cats. Some of them didn't make it. Wait, why are there dogs? Why are there dogs? This this was not a game about dogs. The localization effort must have actually been pretty, pretty immense for this. A 
believe it was all in French to begin with. Might be wrong. I mean, I'm looking at all these J Japanese names and I'm like, mm, am I wrong? <laughs> oh, okay. It's an American team that met at Ubisoft Montpellier and that's why there's so much French influence. Okay, I get, I get it now. I get it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. I will see you next time. Bye!